now we're at the neon lights museum for all of the old hotels and just lights that are around vegas so these are all of the old retired hotel signs and things like that so we're gonna go look at some pretty lights so right off that scan that and it'll tell you about each little sign um, that they have in here and they've got a shop which we're gonna go into after this Tropicana. Oh, look, it says Area 51 up there. Oh, my goodness. It's so big. Look at Moulin Rouge. Sahara. Silver Slipper. Lots. Area 15 Martel. Oh, that's funny. So the guitar is 82 feet tall, roughly. And it's the world's largest light restoration to date. Wow. Look, you can see Caesar's old sign behind there. And that looks like they are from the Stardust. Oh yeah, look, it is Caesar's. This is the flamingo one. And look, Tropicana. So this just goes to show you how tall everything is in comparison. And then you have the Strat. Look, here's the Moulin Rouge. It opened up in 1955. And it played an important role in ending segregation in Las Vegas. Wow. Gosh, the Moulin Rouge is a pretty big sign. You can hear the sound of the lights. Golden Nugget, look. <laughs> Las Vegas Club. El Cortez. I feel like all these like stuff in the background, like it's literally all just like pieced together. Some of the stuff is like really old looking, like from the 60s and 70s. Oh wow, look at this golden nugget sign. Wow. What does this one say? Fitzgerald's. I found your crown. <laughs> Color TV by RCA. <laughs> Look, Lady Luck, 25 cents. This hotel is still around. Whoa. Honey, it like completely opens up. Oh my god, I could not tell what that was until I got up close to it and wasn't sure what I was looking at. But I think that might be the skull from Treasure Island, like something off the building. Look at how massive that is. So, for comparison, look at how tall Ronnie is and look at how big this skull thing is. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
Oh, look, it's the Stardust sign. Wow. Does that say Liberace? I think it does. Yeah, Liberace. Wow. So here's the Stardust and the like, Liberace next to it. You remember seeing the Liberace thing in, um, um, at, hotel, at Resorts World, his little area with his piano, because he, I think he performed at the Stardust. What does this one say? Home of Lido de Paris? Is that what that says? I think that's Aladdin's lamp from the Aladdin Casino. Okay, so this is the main loop, but then he was just telling us that there's an add-on that you can do where it's like a show with other lights. So this is the area where the guy said that there were more signs. This is the north lot, and they have like other signs I guess they do a show to. One hour later. Alright, so it's our first time at a Whataburger. Now we have these in where we're at, but we've never eaten at one, and it's right next to our hotel, so... Ronnie got some onion rings, which I'm gonna try one of these because I love onion rings. And mm, those are good. Mm, Ronnie loves his sauces. So they got jalapeno ranch. Ooh. What is that? Um, honey butter sauce. Honey butter sauce. Yeah, because those... Ronnie got uh, one of the breakfast, breakfast sandwiches. I'm gonna try a bite of that too. We That's got the ketchup. regular ketchup, but they also have Oh, and then spicy, spicy ketchup? ketchup? Okay. And then they have their version of ranch. Original ranch. Okay, we got a lot of stuff going on over here. I forgot what sauce this was. I think this is the one that was supposed to came Oh, so this is the patty sauce melt. that goes on that patty melt. Yeah. Uh -huh. and, and you got the patty melt to try. Also, uh, Dang, you got a lot of sauce here. Okay. Sante, yeah. okay. So, yeah. How's the mm. fries? Good, try them. And apple pie. I got a cheeseburger and Ronnie got a patty melt. Oh, and I also got a chocolate shake because, well, why not? Ronnie's the ranch expert, so he's gonna try the ranch. I tried a little bit of it, it tasted pretty good. I didn't try the spicy ranch though. The jalapeno ranch? Okay. Is it super spicy? No. Let me try a bit. Now I feel the kick. Uh, he says, now I feel the kick. The first is not spicy. But afterwards... Oh, I can taste that. Yeah, after we get it there. Huh? I need all my I've had three. Ronnie said, let's go to breakfast. We want breakfast. So we got a uh, water burger, honey butter, Honey butter chicken, chicken biscuit. biscuit. I, I, I love chicken biscuits, so. I don't know if y'all can see that. And they got a little bit of the special glaze on it. Mmm, that does look good. Yeah. So we're gonna try that out. Apparently, it's supposed to be paired with. Um, the honey butter sauce? Oh, the pecan Yeah. Okay. So, uh. Let's see. Uh, uh, I don't think I'm gonna put it over the whole biscuit. I know you're a dipper. I am a dipper. It's a little harder to put the biscuit. Is that enough? I'll pour some. Oh, there we go. Mm. 
Look at you broadening your horizons. Okay. Alright, let me try it without. You gotta try it with it. I gotta try it with it? Yeah. Okay. What you think? Mm -hmm. A little messy. It is a little messy, but it is but it's good. good. And that picante sauce is good. I don't usually do spicy stuff. Uh, I'm going to add a little bit of this. Uh, it's not working for me. I guess I'm going to have to dip, do some more dipping. Now we got a nice little chunk left. Awesome. Oh. Good with the honey butter? No. Let me try it with some more of the honey butter. Yeah. Honey, good. The honey butter is pretty good. The honey butter is good. The honey butter is where it's at. Okay, so I opened up my burger and it's massive like it's so big like it's big oh my gosh I did not realize how big this is gonna be it's so big okay all right first oh my god this thing is so big like <laughs> as big as my head That's actually not bad. Like, that's, that's really good, actually. I'm probably gonna demolish this now. <laughs> All right. Ronnie's got the patty milk. I got the patty milk. But really, I think they just, uh, they must have ran out of the uh, Texas toast bread. It's supposed to come on Texas oh, toast. Oh, yeah, it's supposed to come on Texas but toast. This is obviously. The sounds of Las Vegas. Uh, Regular. It look, yeah, it looks like patty. two ends of like buds. They just, they and you're just, supposed uh, to, you have a sauce for it. Uh, which sauce is it? This one. Oh, uh, yeah. So it comes with a sauce, but he decided to get it on the side. Yeah. So that's the, that sauce there. I'm going to do like I did before. Yeah, that was onions on this one. Okay. I'm not blown away. I think had you got it the way it was supposed to yeah. be made, you probably would enjoy it. But you have to like change everything about it. Well, no, they just didn't give me the right one. Um, it's supposed to be on Texas toast. Um, and it's it's not on Texas toast. It's just really a, it's the same thing you got. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm gonna try the milkshake. I love chocolate. Mm. Not bad. Not bad. It's actually really good. Could have a little bit more chocolate taste, but it's good. The last thing, guys. Last one. Got a had apple to get pie. Some, yeah, had to get an apple pie. Not cheap, however. It was definitely not cheap. What was it like six dollars for one oh, apple pie? This better be a darn good pastry. I love apple pie. Yeah, love, love, love. Was it six dollars? <clears throat> yes. Yeah, six dollars is a grip. Yeah, for one apple pie. Yeah. It's like uh, five pounds or five point five euros.
What does it taste like other than apple pie? Mm. Kind of gives me a taste of like some throwback apple pie. Yeah. It's not like a McDonald's apple pie. <clears throat> Did you want to try it? No. I know mean, you don't really like it. Yeah, I don't really. The, is, the, um, is the crust kind of like flaky and crispy, but soft on the inside? Yeah. Okay. It's one of those apple pies. Does it have any like sugary like topping on like the crust? Is it kind of sweet? There's a little bit. Yeah. Um, they could use more filling. I don't know if you can tell. I mean, it's some filling. Yeah, more filling. Uh, is it worth six dollars? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> Not something that small. Like, holy cow, six dollars yeah. for that? Um, yeah, only because I'm on vacation. Right? But normally we would have, yeah, you can get uh, two apple pies at McDonald's for about two dollars. Yeah. A little more than that. But when in Vegas? Oh, yeah, on vacation, so, you know. <clears throat> okay, so Ronnie just did something that made me think, oh my God, did I get him stoned? What did you just do? He dipped his apple pie, pie in the honey, honey, honey butter. butter. <laughs> I mean, it's like more filling. Yeah. It's pretty good, actually. There you go. New dipping sauce for apple pie is water burger. I'm helping you out. Well, let's like drop it down to maybe $3. Yeah, $3 for the apple pie and not 6 